The Rolling Stones played a surprise gig for fans in Los Angeles on Saturday, a week ahead of kicking off a U.S. tour to mark 50 years in the music business. Hundreds of fans alerted on the band's Twitter account lined up as early as 5 a.m. on Saturday to get a hold of the $20 tickets for the concert at the 320-person capacity Echoplex Club in Los Angeles. The veteran British rockers will officially launch a 17-date North American 50 and counting tour on May 3rd in L.A. Mark Wahlberg's dark comedy Pain and Gain brought enough box office muscle to knock Tom Cruise out of the number one spot on movie charts in the U.S. and Canada. Pain and Gain took in 20 million over its first three days, according to studio estimates released on Sunday. Cruise's sci-fi thriller Oblivion slipped to second place with 17.5 million, bringing its two-week domestic total to 64.7 million. The baseball drama 42 about Jackie Robinson's debut as Major League Baseball's first black player finished in third place with 10.7 million while Iron Man 3 hauled in 195 million in 42 international markets a total that surpassed the international opening of the Avengers the movie arrives in the US and Canada on Friday to kick off Hollywood's lucrative summer blockbuster season acting legend Jane Fonda cemented her stardom on Hollywood's Walk of Fame on Saturday laying down her hand in shoe prints outside the TCL Chinese Theater the 75-year-old Oscar winner placed her prints in concrete next to those of her late father, Henry Fonda, calling it her highest honor.